Hello, it's Angela from Create for Living. I'm really excited today. I'm getting to share with you a weekly spread from my bullet journal. And you'll see I'm busy um, using my Faber Castell F pen, F size pen to draw um, a hummingbird and some florals around the outside um, for my weekly spread. Now, in my weekly spread, what I normally do is have a space for each of the days and then a space for some of the other categories that I'm wanting to record some memories in, some things that I'm celebrating or learning or grateful for or watching or reading, any category that I feel like I'd like to record that week and I kind of change them in um, month from month or week to week. I like to use this Faber-Castell pen because it's waterproof so that I can do all the detailing in pen and when I add watercolour later that's still going to show through. So you can see I'm busy putting all little lines and little detailing on the wings and on the feathers on the tail so that you can see all those little details of the feathers just to give it a bit more texture and all of that will show through when I put watercolour on top in a moment. I'm also putting some detailing in the petals and you'll see I'm putting details in the top end and the bottom end of the petals to make them look more realistic and now I'm just adding some more leaves so that you get this overall shape throughout. So a little bit of fauna and I really like how this page looks so far. Alright so now I'm going to use my Kuretake Ganzai Tambi watercolour paints in a moment to paint on top of this and add some of those incredible colours that the hummingbird has. And so I'm going to be using different kinds of pinks and purples um, and a little bit of blues to create this sort of shimmery colour um, with brightness. I'm using wet on wet a little bit to get the colours to mix so that you get these different shades. And then just picking up some other colours such as yellow, orange and green so that you get this kind of um, rainbow effect, some bright colours, warmer colours, but also some cooler colours. Now, when I'm busy painting, one of the things that I think about is I think of colour like you would sound. So the way that sound echoes throughout a room, that's how I think about paints. And I try and echo those colours throughout. So on one end I might have a colour, I might try and attach it on another end. So you'll see that I've managed to put some of the floral colours on that were on the bird. I've also put on the, on the florals and tried sort of at three points around the shape. Do that so it adds to the overall shape. And then I've just added in the days and I'm adding at the top what I would like to learn, what I'm enjoying, what things I'm hoping and who I'm connecting with. And that's my weekly spread. Just adding a little bit of Tombow detailing to bring in those feathers and I also thought I would try adding a bit of water to the Tombow brush pens so that I could see how they blend together and that worked pretty well to give my overall effect. I'm sorry this footage is a little bit overexposed but you'll see in a moment the overall effects. So I hope you enjoyed seeing me create this page. Please like and subscribe for more videos. See you soon. Alright.